welcome to a new episode of MMORPG Unity tutorial and in this lecture I want to show you how to create the config file we need later and the connection handler base included the package types. Okay, uh, in this lecture we will create our Yukinet or some stuff from our Yukinet. We don't create everything. Um, and at first we have to create a new file. So add new item. And yeah, um, I will type JSON uh, in this text field and we will create a JSON file and yeah we create our config because in this file we put our connection strings and stuff like this so we um, type connection strings and then we need to open this and i will tell my SQL and then we will say server local host user ID is root pv pass is for password and we will leave it empty because I use XAMPP and with the default settings but if you have uh, you uh, need to to put your um, stuff here, and if you want to use uh, SQLite or something else, you need to edit this this one, or you can add a new with um, uh, you can add a new new line with um, light or something else. And our database will be MMORPG two. And sorry, we don't need this here. And we also need to say SSL mode none because we are on localhost and my localhost don't like it. And we um, say, mm, yeah, we say uh, data was and here we will um, declare our max players uh, because then we can use it in our um, in our space in our uh, server. And now we need to add our host and we need to say null 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 null. And then we say our port is three five six three four five six. Uh, you can use um, every port you want, so no worry if your port is another. And now we can go to class one, and I will rename it. It's a standard um, class file when you open a new project and we will call it connection handler base um yeah we need it um i will rename it here so it will renamed in 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 our file as well and um we say we need to do this as abstract class because we want to use um this handler base in in every connection file we need so um i need to put a key here and now we can say protected abstract handle unknown unknown package and we say t connection and it's yeah, um, this is a function from 
from C sharp so we can um we can uh put here our um connection type so we can put there our package parser or or something else like um we'll do in in a later video i can explain it a little bit better uh because we don't uh create this type here and um yeah we need to say commun communication package and say type i will create it in the end of the file so it's underlined and yeah and as um, next we will um, say public void invoke action um, this is for our um, connection for our packages and we yeah we can um communi communication package um yeah this function we need for um to start our um method methods we yeah to execute our met methods um so we need to search in in our get type and get method uh so we can um execute our maybe handle login or something else but um i will um explain it in a later video a little bit more um yeah sorry i need to do an s here and then we can say war attribute equal to math dot get custom attrib attribute and we say package handler attribute we will create after this and we need to add using system reflection namespace in the top and yeah then we can say if attribute is null then we can say continue and then we say if attribute type dot type is equals to type um then we can start our math dot invoke and we can execute our method and then we can say return so and if this uh yeah and then we can say Uh, one moment, I need to check where I... Yeah, so and in here we need to say uh, we need to execute our handle un noun package and say connection parsed data and our type And I forgot here a void. Of course, we don't want to, uh, we don't need to get anything back. And yeah, then uh, now we can uh, create our attribute usage. And we say attribute 
targets with method and then we say public class package handler attribute and we inherited it from attribute and then we can say public package handler attribute communication package type and then we say uh, then we say type is equal to type and then we say public communication package type get and as you can see we got an error here um, this is because we need to create our communication package and therefore we need to add a new file and the file would be called uh, add new item and we now we need a new class file so i will class in it and we need to call it a packet types and then we say public enum and we say we call it communication package and we need to say uint 33 and then we can say login request is equal to null x null null one and then we can add a few other oh, sorry uh, then we can uh, add a few other i will put it here and we need to say login response response uh, and we need to put it here Th then we can say race request we can say race re response and we need to add uh, three or four then we can say char request and char response so so then we need a keep alive package um and we need an error so we call it with f and then we can save and can see if we have any errors yes we have errors because we need to add the namespace um okay i have misspelling here and now some spelling error and yes that would be the connection handler and we will see us in the next video thank you for watching